This is where it all begins, the corn field. One bushel of corn yields about 2.8 gallons of ethanol. One acre of corn can produce enough ethanol to run a car for 72,000 miles on E10. When the corn is harvested, it is brought to the ethanol plant where it goes through a process to change into ethanol. This is an ethanol plant in Hartley, Iowa. We will briefly demonstrate how ethanol is produced in the plant. We have two different types of ethanol here. I have E10, which is 10% corn, 90% gasoline. And I have E85, which is 85% corn. And 15% gasoline. Distiller's grain is a byproduct of ethanol which farmers feed to their cattle. It comes in two forms, wet and dry. Wet distillers have a greater energy value than corn grain and dry distillers have energy equal to corn. Both cost less than regular grain, so feeding dried or wet distillers result in a greater profit for the cattle producer. Producing ethanol requires less water than gasoline by a 3 to 1 margin. Ethanol contains 230% more energy than it takes to produce it. These are two examples of how ethanol is better for the environment than gas. Iowa leads the nation in ethanol production, creating nearly 30% of all ethanol. The ethanol industry results in 50,000 new jobs in Iowa and accounts for $13 billion of Iowa GDP. These prove how important ethanol is in Iowa. Whoa, where the green